Right, this is Ashes to Angels. Right. Yes, yes it is. Three fourths. Yes. We can They're all like, beautiful. I feel like I'm a, <laughs> a half a person. <laughs> Two and okay. a half. Yeah. <laughs> okay. But the box with the questions, we've got questions, so. Are you ready? Open it and what right, number I'm you ready. get? 23. 23. That's really awkward. Like your combination of number and box technology. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I do, it's very effective. What is your favourite villain? Ooh, who? Really? Sorry, who are we doing? <laughs> <laughs> Best villain ever. <laughs> That's pretty difficult. I don't know, man. Really good villains. Let's go anti hero <laughs> and circumvent the question. <laughs> we'll just go straight for Batman. Yeah, <laughs> Batman is kind of evil. Um, Venom, obviously, Venom. It's true for me. <laughs> Velociraptors in Jurassic Park. <laughs> you go. They're not really there. Velociraptors, which is what makes them wicked. <laughs> I, yeah, I would also be afraid if they, if they were tiny and feathered and worked as a team. Good not open doors then. No thumbs. That's a brilliant answer. <laughs> yeah, I'm on the that. Okay. What's your answer? Uh, I don't know. Um, just a classic Joker, maybe. Yeah, oh no, yeah. Magneto. Mm -hmm. Because of his yeah. wonderful relationship with Xavier. <laughs> <laughs> Jade approves. Wait, wait. Yeah, yeah. I've said Pinhead. But from Hellraiser. Yeah. I like him. Oh, what? He's just doing his job, man. What, what, one of the, one of the uh, Cenobites, the one with the... <laughs> <laughs> okay, next question. Perfect. Do you want to pick another question? Uh, oh, what have you done? <laughs> <laughs> to open the elephant. <laughs> Where do you want the band to be in five years? They're still in this van. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, we just did Europe for the first time. We'd like to do more of that, because I think the UK might be getting a little sick of us no. <laughs> playing. No, 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 no. This is our first time in Liverpool. And I'm a, like, we played, on average, one show every three days for the past year and a half, wow. so we've got to branch out so we never have to face the real world. Five years is a long time. We could have broken up and we formed by then. We could be on the Reformation tour. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> had a rehab. He had yeah. crashed five or six cars at that point. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I want to do. <laughs> Expensive. Okay. Mm. How about you guys? Do you have any rehab. plans? Rehab. <laughs> There you go. Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll be in the methadone clinic just next door. <laughs> oh, please don't. I'll be out of backy in like five minutes. <laughs> I can't believe they offer me drugs. <laughs> now my teeth hurt. <laughs> 28. 28. There. Mm, something in my teeth. Do you ever get scared or nervous meeting new fans, bands, or new people? Yeah, rules. We are pretty free. Yeah. It depends how aggressive the fans are. Sometimes I like to cower in a corner. <laughs> it's like, ah, but yeah. no, everyone's usually fine. He yeah. used to hide behind his iPhone, but now he can't. <laughs> iPhone broke. Yeah, so broken. So broken. So damaged. So damaged. I didn't even so like do anything to mine, it just stopped working. <laughs> uh, yeah, no, that's kind of like what happened to Jim's, is that like totally 100% different. <laughs> <laughs> I don't was know. it under a car at any point? No. <laughs> oh, that would be better. I don't know if he's ready for the world to know this it's... story. <laughs> we could make it a YouTube exclusive. Yeah, you heard what? it here first. <laughs> Jim, do you want to explain to the world? No, you, <laughs> yeah, do it. You, guys, do you, guys, it. you guys can tell it a better way than I can. Oh, I think it would just stick to the facts that you accidentally shit on your iPhone. <laughs> <laughs> and then flushed it. Honestly, not as bad as what I did. Coming back from Italy, I dropped my phone in the toilet. It's yeah. way worse. Yeah, but did you it's shit on your phone? Flushed. Yeah, but it, it wasn't even mine. He then flushed. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it's, it your, it's your it story, clean. but with active shitting. <laughs> <laughs> He's basically levelled up on your story. <laughs> Plus, it was on his anniversary in Paris, <laughs> and it was a gift. <laughs> uh, Nico, we're doing an interview. Can you fuck up? <laughs> <laughs> I can. I'm gonna eat. Get in the van. <laughs> What's your worst gig experience? No, no. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> this. The chef was pretty bad. That top. Oh yeah, that was pretty bad. But that was yeah. That, that was pretty bad. Yeah, like come on, uh, I've, I've, you know, you know, 
But that was just extremely disheartening and upsetting. Everything shut down. Yeah, but at least which the menu was nice. Which was the one where you got threatened to be stabbed by someone with a spoon? <laughs> what? Oh, that was Leeds. That was right. <laughs> oh, I'll go with that. Yeah. Shed. Shed. Yeah. Someone spilled water all over a laptop. It oh. was sacred betrayal. Now they broke it up. <laughs> Never and that's it, why, I that's know. why they broke up. <laughs> Do I have a worst gig experience? Um, I think it was pretty bad. Blue Cat Cafe, I think, gets an honourable message. <laughs> <mention. laughs> no, no, that was the one that was coming straight out of my mouth first. <laughs> yeah. And, uh, oh, we're playing by the attic. Yeah, we are. Yeah. <laughs> we'll see where tonight ranks on the scale, because there's six bands. <laughs> yeah, I was thinking that was... I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I don't like it. The rules. To be honest, to come in to get your Barbara, oh, lovely. We've seen yeah. them a few times. Oh, yeah, everybody's really been nice. super nice, but six bands in like three and a half hours is Way actually impossible. Mm. Your turn. Yeah. More elephant fun. Really? My That's turn. <laughs> Elephanty goodness. <laughs> I got out of my trunk. <laughs> Smoking out. Take no. away from my home. <laughs> <laughs> it's either a six or a nine or a B. <laughs> it's probably my dodgy. That's a nine. It's a nine. Or a B. No, no, it's a, it's a nine. <laughs> Guys, don't. I'm writing them in a hurry. Okay, where's nine? Do you prefer listening to heavy or acoustic music? Neither. <laughs> <laughs> Anything that's good, really. Yeah. 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 I wrote the best things. three. <laughs> okay. Yeah. I think it kind of depends on what you're doing. I mean, if yeah. you're on a long so, drive, so. you don't want to put on a folk album. <laughs> All I'm saying. Depends on what you're into. <laughs> All I'm saying is you'll like never be asleep. a good bit of Savage Garden. Mm. I exclusively <laughs> write fan fiction about Savage Garden. Whoa! <laughs> it's like a first, yeah. Got <laughs> Nick in my trips. Oh, I will stab you. Oh, the Seven Garden porn is two. 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 Uh, two. Uh, who you inspired you to follow the music career? Hmm? You do uh, something because you're nice, not to bring it up later. Well, I, it's super, super cool. lame. Share like, if you agree. The musicians that inspired me to pick up a guitar. Cool. It was like yeah. Frank Iero. Don't do it. And a guy yeah. called Mike Oldfield, who wrote the, well, the music for The Exorcist. Yeah. What about you? Uh, me. You inspired yourself? <laughs> yes. Yes. Mm. Self inspiration. Well, I learned guitar from like the age of six, so I'm kind of always like. I was going to say Nick Cave. Mm. Oh, I was already in a band before that. That was last week. <laughs> <laughs> you don't understand. He was gonna give up. <laughs> I think he's upset now. I don't fucking give a shit. So was it like six, seven thousand pounds? My personal expense Stop. to make the tour happen? <laughs> Bitching about chips. <laughs> Bullshit. That's what it is. <laughs> don't ever do anything nice if you're then gonna throw it back in someone's face later on. It's ridiculous. Just do it because you want to. Wow. Wise words. Yeah. <laughs> Microphone for you to drop. <laughs> 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 Everything squeals, it'll be great. What about you two? Who inspired you to follow a music career? Uh, um, He's going to say the guy from Durham Gray. No. <laughs> yeah, I was a bass idol in school. <laughs> yeah, I was a bass idol, not why I, why I started music. I thought you meant Yoshi the dinosaur from, from Mario. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, <laughs> I like David Bowie. David Bowie's oh, yes. a bad man. Mm -hmm. And Robert Smith. <laughs> if you could go back in time, what would you do or tell someone? Uh, restart year six. <laughs> <laughs> restart year six. Like yeah, from just then year onwards. Six, from or? then onwards, that's where it started to go down. <laughs> <laughs> to be fair, I'd. Do what you said in your status, like concentrate in PE and run away. Yeah, from my responsibilities, that bit's important. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> do it anyway. Dude, I don't even fucking live here. I'd take even less shit. I've fucking no teeth left. Um, I have no idea. I don't know, man. I go pretty deep on this one, so I'm not going to. <laughs> okay. I will. <clears throat> Okay. <laughs> this could take forever, so I'm just gonna go and like, I don't know, I'd 
go back and see Michael Jackson perform. Yeah. Yeah, so mm. yeah, yeah, that'd be pretty worth it. Well, I'd go back to Nirvana. Anything that could result in me. I think I'd use my, my one do over to fix a mistake at the same time. Yeah. Yeah. Jackson. <laughs> 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 I'm just staying away from. I'd go back and be like, hey, dude, it's alright to be black. <laughs> it doesn't matter if you're black or white. Yeah, man. Inspire him to write that song. Go back and stop the whole Biggie Tupac situation. Yeah, oh, or I could go and jump up in front of the fucking gun. Yeah. I'll but then you'd up. die in real life. We'd have to shoot Suge Knight. <laughs> I'll take him out. Yeah. <laughs> Is this a plot? <laughs> What, to kill Shug Knight? <laughs> it's unstoppable. It would take... You couldn't do it. Nine of us with rhino guns. You just still keep coming. Like, <laughs> Shug, no! <laughs> just <laughs> dangling it all off a balcony. He's like, you want to see what I did to vanilla ice? <laughs> Paris. Over. <laughs> Omar. Omar. Four. Sorry, I didn't know what to do. That's right, nor do I. <laughs> That's what he said. <laughs> <laughs> it looks like an ex did a baby with the left and right lines. If you could be one of the artists for a day, who would you be and why? Van Gogh, cut off your ear, cut off your ear! <laughs> <laughs> um, there's a lot of people who are like, oh, I don't fucking care. The same people are like, oh, I'm so depressed. All I want to do is watch Disney movies all day. Like, oh, you're a fucking oxymoronic cunt with emphasis on the moron. That sort of fell apart. I was I'll go with Valo. All I do is smoke. Not much difference, to be honest. Sweet. Like, you know. Smoke I'd, four more like, I'd like to do to be like one <laughs> of the one really, of really really pretentious room. like yeah. jazz musicians or something. <laughs> Just like spend the entire day being a pretentious arsehole and everyone would be absolutely fine with it. Yeah. Go to music yeah. and be like, yes, I do want flat rounds. <laughs> <laughs> Who would I be? Kia No, I want to be Travis Bistrava. He rides motorcycles. But he's really good at it. <laughs> 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 Most attractive female band member. Falco. <laughs> Hi. Nico. <laughs> Myself. How <are> you doing? <laughs> Porcelain black. Obviously. Are you just gonna do real answers or are you just gonna go with it? That's it. Yep. It's me. Yeah. Me. <laughs> I don't know. Jenna Jet still got it. Also, the problem is, like, we know a lot of pretty, pretty people in bands. However, there's something about being on the road that means you kind of have to adapt to survive, which generally requires being a little bit grimy. In fact, the only, I would say, quite clean touring musician who I know is Olivia. Yes. Uh, <laughs> you say Lisa? Yeah, Lisa's pretty clean, but then she's engaged. That keeps you clean. I don't know, I don't really fucking look at people too much what? like that, especially not once you know them. <laughs> I don't even look at people. Yeah, I was just like, We're eyes down. We're all the time. <laughs> Once you know someone, like, you've got other things to think about other than what they look like. Mm. Like, are they going to let me in their house? Do they have any pets? Can I stroke the cats? <laughs> Will there be somewhere to plug in the blender? It's the important thing to see. I have stopped the just the what is that Wi-Fi password. Yeah. Do they oh. have, like, a rich no. Pen no. parent or benefactor who's going to be like, yeah, you can use the hot tub? <laughs> this must be a six, because we have it. Yes, right? it's a six. Yeah, oh, we've had that. It's <laughs> so grumpy. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> I knew what it was. But yeah. Oh, I wanted this right. question. Who's your favourite and least favourite pop artist or band? That was five. Yeah, that is five. That's five. Marvel or DC? Five. I wanted that Jesus. one too. Oh, I wanted to do the pop one. Which one are we you doing? You can do the which, pop which one. Which question? Michael Jackson, <laughs> the best. Nicki Minaj is the best. Which is weird, because he likes Lady Gaga and they're the same. They're not the same. They are, they've got nothing to say. Oh, you're an idiot. I'm not an idiot. Vicious you agrees with me. I fuck Vicious. She's a bad. Yep. <laughs> this answer both. Who's sad. your favourite and least favourite favorite pop artist and Marvel or DC? Uh, <laughs> favourite pop artist? Namco. Well, I'm just going to turn this round. <laughs> Probably Marvel consistently. But yeah, like DC Marvel does have Batman. But yeah, Marvel's Marvel. got a lot of good stuff. Yeah. Marvel. The Avengers one. 
Yeah. Marvel in the long nice game of the amount that's one. out there, but DC for Batman. As to favourite and worst pop star, I don't, I don't know. If I don't like something, I just don't listen to it. Yeah. I used to creatively hate stuff, just dedicate real time and energy to disliking it, and that didn't make them go away. I don't think. Michael. <laughs> <laughs> I'm oh, sorry, it was one day. Um, <coughs> yeah, it was just a waste of energy that I could have spent on enjoying other music and being more open minded. So uh, that's why Starships were made to fly. <laughs> wow. Let's do this one more time. <laughs> I don't like that song. That song sucks. But you know. I quite like that song. She's like, hey, the song's okay. okay. She's basically. Yeah, bad influence. Her rapping skills are right up there with the greats like Tiger. <laughs> I just hate lazy rappers, I think it's problem. Lazy yeah. rappers and bad production upset Still me. Mm. How hard is it? <laughs> <laughs> Fucking Method Man explained it. Fire at the keyboard, wonderful tempo. Then all you have to do is be good at rapping, and all that really is, is learning how to use your mouth. Fast. Kanye West used to be fucking incredible, but Kanye West used to lock himself in the studio and wouldn't come out until he had written several songs a day. And that's how he got good. And then something happened between him and Will I Am where they were like, you know what we could do? <laughs> fucking nothing. Because Will I Am, Black Eyed Peas, they were yeah. awesome. Yeah. And then there's just something, it's like this progression something in US hip hop. just fades away. Yeah. yeah deep. <laughs> I think it's like hit like a saturation point of Wicked and like there's so many like quite. Like there's odd futures and these people are doing hip hop in like a different way, more aggressive way, but they're not getting the recognition, but they will, their time will come, either that or the whole thing will go and suddenly we're gonna be popular again. Woo! Yeah. Who knows? We're gonna quit do hip hop. Yeah. What <laughs> <coughs> day? I got skills. I got skills. He does. <laughs> I might do. Jim, you've been very quiet. What? <laughs> I like it. Michael Jackson. Don't know. <laughs> there you go. My info. <laughs> I have no idea who you guys were talking about. I, I assume you were talking about Nicki Minaj, but I had no yes. idea what that song was. Good. Not missing out. It's a good thing. I, think, <laughs> yeah. I, I assume that ignorance is bliss. Yes. Yeah, definitely. Wicked. I think that you would I like it though. Lemon! I genuinely think that you would what? dance to it at a party. That's. Oh, that just I sounds a bit weird. Though. Change yeah. it. Unless I'm really Pick a different one. No, just no. say it. Uh, what's your favourite scent? Scent? scent. Yeah. Let's be all fancy. Jean Paul Gaultier, very irresistible. Is the only one I remember. Black Excess or the f or Fame. Those are my two. Fresh like car. <laughs> <laughs> Petrol. That is a really nice moment. Yeah. Fresh the van when we got it. WD 40. <laughs> Good roll of duct tape. <laughs> I quite, oh, I quite like the smell of Versace blue jeans because it reminds me of my passion. I'm finally starting to get, like, when we walk into the, the changing room, when we get a changing room, I no longer associate the scent of Axe deodorant with an imminent beating. <laughs> so that's quite pleasant. Food, I like the smell of food. The smell of food. <laughs> yeah, the smell of finding an open McDonald's at four in the morning. Oh. That's, <laughs> that's good. Brings a tear. Yeah. I think we've done with that. Yeah, yeah. yeah. grabbing them. Anyone? Nah. Whoa! Exactly. Don't break the ball! It's not broke. It's a terrible. <laughs> I'm just enjoying hitting Nico. Oh, Children, no, no behave! Be retribution. <laughs> I just. Oh, Adam. You're not my favourite scent. <laughs> <laughs> I think you might be, you know. Why have you like his gone on that angle now? Ah, because I have no angle to go. That that's isn't much better. I have no angle. <laughs> down. That isn't. Resting a plug well, up my arsehole. Yes. Uh, what animals would you it. say each other are? Goat. <laughs> <laughs> Eats anything, smells funny. Look at that. Okay. And he's got them hourglass shaped pupils, that's what I think. <laughs> he is lizard people. Lizard Blinks in the <laughs> <laughs> He's also kind of like a sloth, but he's got insomnia. Which he cures by sleeping all the time. Deco is like a sexy praying mantis. <laughs> Jim? What's Jim? I'd say some kind of like a little dog. 
<laughs> a dog. A chihuahua. Yeah. Not a chihuahua. No, 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 no. no. Do you consider potatoes like a potato to be a Jack, not, Like a Jack Russell no, or one of those like, little, like, little snoutier phases, but I can't remember. I'd say you're a gorilla's thumb. Gorilla's <laughs> thumb. <laughs> I would say okay. you're a gorilla who was taught hand sign language but didn't like talking to its people, so it just didn't. Like the guy who spoke to Robin Williams. <laughs> Please stop. Well, I'm sad. Hey, there's Someone... a sadder story about that gorilla. Its kitten got hit by a truck and they had to explain the concept of death to a gorilla that they taught how to speak. <laughs> it's like, all ball gone. All ball gone. All gone. Hit by truck. <laughs> Sad. Who should not mother? Who should not mother? I'm not making this up. No. They didn't ask for tickles. Would you like that seems to be all it asked, Robin Williams. No, it just Thank got you. so sad. What is the most rock and roll thing that you each of you have done? Oh man. <laughs> oh, Every nothing. time a question like this that comes up, I think of your phone. I'm sorry. Oh, no, that's <laughs> yeah, look at this, boys. <laughs> right on it. We're so rock and roll we fall asleep on ferries. <laughs> yeah, I did all of my rock and roll stuff before the band actually started getting oh, anywhere. But, uh, I would say keeping it fairly clean. Um, <laughs> when we went into clan of blah blahs dressing room. Oh yeah, yeah, we, yeah. yeah. we brought a kid to <clears throat> the dressing room and stole all of their wine. Yeah, and the coke, don't forget the coke! Oh yeah, and a bottle of coke, and we did it like Metal, metal Gear Solid style. Did you have like Nerf guns to keep it cool? Not at that time. We were. CQC, that, that, was, that, that was pretty good. Yeah, and guns when you got CQC. <laughs> we were already like a two yeah. litre bottle of Jack Daniels Stolen. in. <laughs> Sorry. His shoes descended to the van alone. Yeah. That was N pretty funny. Nico's shoes Keep got to the van before him. I was in the van, I don't know how they got there. I wasn't drunk, I was just there. I was. He was drunk. He, he was, was dancing. <laughs> oh yeah, we were we were <laughs> stage jumping. We were doing a lot of shit. <laughs> <laughs> he would be in a nuisance from the sounds of it. Having a right old time of it. <clears throat> I got the excellent honour of being the only dude to ever fucking stage dive at Whitby. Woo. Well. See, I just skated my knee on stage, so now I don't wear the giant fucking boots anymore, which I guess is probably good on account of all the climbing. I don't know. I like it. I like it. I'm gonna pick another question. Uh, yes, I'm gonna go and help. Hold this, please. Ooh, what's your biggest fear? Closer to arm. What? What? You say arm? No. Oh shit, flashbacks are in the trees. Oh no, Charlie's. Charlie Chaplin everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> Charlie Chaplin, uh, you were Batman. Thank you. I really don't like needles. I, I really hate injections. Anything and everything hit me in the face. You know, there is like all See, this and stuff. I, I'm scared of injections, but I could get a Yeah, yeah, like it's, it's totally something thing. different. It feels more like a knife being dragged across. Yeah. What's the question again? Hooray. It's quite painful West in fear. itself, but it doesn't West feel like something's puncturing is. through. Yeah. Loss. Loss. And that's what I don't like, it's the whole. Yeah. <laughs> going in. I'm and scared then of everything that's been said through. so far, actually. <laughs> yeah. No. So we've got things hit in face. I remember the time when Crony had to re-pierce your lip because you took it out for a job. And then when he tried to put it back in, you passed out in his mum's bathroom. Yeah, he was, was using a, he was using a blunt lip. <laughs> was it like that seed off he was using <laughs> <laughs> We need a new lip. <laughs> he was using, a, <laughs> he was using a, a blunt, um, like literally just my lip stud. To pierce, oh. re-pierce the hole. Oh. Try to. So I was not having me, yeah. a good time when he was doing that. Who's the best band or artist you've played with? Um. My band. <laughs> we haven't even practiced. <laughs> Nor have you played with them, which is the kind of more important. I've played with some. I'll probably say you're gonna say my passion, surely. No. Uh, probably as an artist and as a friend. So it would probably be William Control. Mm. Yeah. You say you They're all great. They're all great. I like them. I like them. I like them. I like their music. I they like are them. nice people. <laughs> I like their jokes. <laughs> I like their slang. I like it. Yeah, it's it's pretty pretty fun touring with Will. What about you, Jim? <laughs> Do you say the same? Do your you Nixon, like it? Your Nixon impression is just bang on. <laughs> Looks like my family, like my two brothers and then me in the middle, like, like <laughs> not having it.
Get out. Uh, I think we all had the same thing, so. Will. Yeah. Will. If not, maybe. Nah, I don't know. Fuck everyone else. I would say Lost Alone. No, you wouldn't. Hmm. I would. I thought they were really great. <laughs> You're in you Lost Alone. You can't say that. I am every member of <laughs> Lost Alone combined. I got used by them. They used me as a staff. Did to you get like off it? Stage. <laughs> <laughs> like it? <laughs> 46! Right, okay, right. right to the back. Stay with that accent for the entirety of your life. The duration. Right. If I must, I must. must. Any advice for any newer fans? Don't, do uh, don't be from Bristol. <laughs> Don't join the band, go to college. Alright, we should let him. I don't. I can't. <laughs> no, like Any it. advice for other bands other than, you know, don't do it? What do they, do they say anything amazing? Do they get anything upsetting? Jim's done a talking like in the West Country. Uh, I'm gonna smoke this cigarette. 